Ortega. Hey, today's a mission choke. Man, you guys are not smiling, Nigerians. You people are not smiling at all. So Tega and Boma left together today. Hey, for this video, I'm going to go accordingly so that I don't miss out on any details because today's eviction was, you know, as expected to an extent. So, but yeah, if you are new to this channel, please be able to subscribe, turn on your post notifications so that I can get notified each time I post a brand new video. And don't forget to give this video a what a big big thumbs up. So Tega has been evicted. Do you know, some part of me feels like for her to come out now, it's not really a good idea because a lot of people are waiting for her, waiting to troll, literally troll. Man, it's going to be crazy. But yeah, Tega has been evicted from the house. So after she came out, she was looking all excited and Ebuka asked her some questions. He said, do you miss your husband? And she said, I miss my husband. And did you miss your husband? I miss my husband, oh my God. Really? really then he now went on to ask her about other things like what's up with boma and she said um herself and boma are just friends and then everything that was happening with them was just a script and they are good actors that she's sure we enjoyed the movie i did not enjoy it though <laughs> me i did not enjoy the movie sha well, that was the script that we um, had to play out to we're good actors anyway so um, i'm sure you guys had a good time how do you think your husband took this he's a bad guy now you understand so it's all good it's all good then ibuka shattered a table if we can ask Jay Paul that which one was a bigger highlight for him, whether him within head of house, or be him in the head of house lounge, or his late night kiss with Sasuke. Hey. Was it winning the head of house or the late night kiss with Sasuke? Ah. Hey, Ebuka, they were now laughing and he's like, um, both, but for him, like J Paul now said it was his time he spent with Sasuke. Cross was just there, like, hmm. Um, I think both, but I'll take the late night um, time that we spent together. That was actually special for me. I'm happy, I'm actually happy that Ibuka said that so that at least Cross know where he stands, she gets. Then Ibuka also asked Jackie B about her situationship in the house. He said that some of them, they will be in, they will say they're not in relationships, but they will have a relationship problem. So what is up? And Jackie B was saying that, okay, because there are feelings involved, that's why you see all of that, that it's friendship, but obviously that there are feelings involved in her own case. So that's why we are seeing relationship problems. We're all in friendships, let me call it that. But because there's feelings involved, you know, it kind of makes us kind of, you know, things that would normally not be upset about, you know, they end up getting upset because of the feelings involved. Then for the next eviction, Nibuka went in and carried two people, Peace and Michael. Peace, please leave the big brother house. Nini was crying. I was like, oh, sorry, baby girl. Peace is actually very lucky because Last week she would have been evicted if that Maria was not up, if she was not replaced. And then this week she won money. So she's actually going out on a very good note. Even Michael, Michael, Michael is living as the richest person in the house. He won 2.5 million coupled with the other ones that he has won. So 4.7 million. So he's actually living on a good note. Michael, you're not safe. Please leave the big brother house. Two, one. Then when Michael came out, Ibuka asked him what's up with him and Jackie B and he's like they are still figuring things out that there's no definition yet. They are still figuring things out and Ibuka was like do you plan to pursue things with her outside and he's like yeah of course. There's no definition, there's no definitive thing or course of action per se so yeah. Is there something you want to explore outside the house? Yeah for sure, awesome stuff. So we are thinking, we are expecting to see a continuation of Jackie B and Michael's ship, Michael Jackson's ship outside of the house meanwhile angel was crying after they told her that she has been saved and i was like baby girl it's lo it looks like you're not going anytime soon so you may have some more tears to come <laughs> <laughs> Then we had a performance from Aya Star and it was amazing. I can't put everything here because it's a music video, it's, it's a song, so it definitely has copyright. But Aya Star performed and it was good. Open your counter, sip from your bottle and vibe. So Ibuka asked Peace, what's up with Michael? That looks like there was something there. And she's like, nah, that there's nothing extra with Michael. That that's the way she was with most of the male housemates. So there's nothing special there. And there's nothing special for between her and any other person in the house. So there's basically nobody in the house that she really, really 
likes? Nah, my cat is my friend. Like, it's really nothing. Like, come on. It's nothing. Like, I was like that with everyone, if you actually think about it. I was like that with Cross. With Michael. Then Rema also did a performance on stage. So we had two artists, and two of them are the new brand ambassadors for Pepsi. So they performed on stage. <laughs> then Buma was evicted from the house. The house means we are shocked. I even heard somebody shouting, How? I'm like, <laughs> People don't even know that people are not joking this time around. People are very serious. So Buma was evicted. Buma. And when Buma came out of the house, um, Ibuka asked him what's up with Tega and he said that they are just cool, Tega is cool, so there's nothing more. It's alright, we're going to take what they're telling us, so Tega and Buma are out of the house. No, no, forget Pasta. She's, what's up with her now? She's amazing, she's cool. Like, yeah. You guys are more than cool maybe? What did you say? Are you more than cool? No, we're just okay. Cool. Then the voting polls as usual, they showed us the least six. And you guys, did you see the results? So Tega had the least votes and zero point something percent. And Boma also had zero point something percent. I have a feeling that they're going to use it to throw them because that's going to be the talk of the uh, matter, the talk of the eviction, zero point something percent votes. Hey, <laughs> God. So I think that happened because a lot of them were up. So it's expected that the percentages will be like little, little, little. Saga and Nini would have gone if they did like six evictions, which I thought they were going to do because the way they said king size eviction, I thought maybe we were going to see like six, seven people out of the house. They only removed four. So like what's the difference? They did three last week, four this week. So there's nothing king size about this eviction. Hey, Buka. Hey, Buka. So Yusuf and Sasuke are not, okay, Sasuke, I didn't even expect her to be like in the, in the like bottom six, I guess, because I think um, she's liked by a lot of people. Yusef, Yusef, Yusef has just been like up up there. It look like it look like nobody's talking about him during the week, and then boom, Evishon comes and you're not going to see his name there. Hmm. It's all right. We are going to keep watching to see how everything plays out. Let's see what's going to happen tomorrow and then throughout the week. So thanks for watching, guys. And don't forget to give this video a big, big thumbs up, and I'm going to see you in my next video. Bye. Love you.